I'm Curtis. Uh, I joined the Army in 1964. I uh, have a total of 21 years plus. So I'm, I'm retired from the service. I retired as a first sergeant. I did my term of Vietnam in 1967, 1968. That's the worst year of the war, as far as I'm concerned. After about maybe a year, that's when you realize something's really wrong. And you don't want to tell nobody. I was drinking too much. I was smoking too much. I was, uh, wasn't doing what I was supposed to do as a man, as a husband. Wiped him, I was running, really <laughs> running out on me. You know, that's when I knew I was in really bad shape. We were sitting up eating out one night. She said, you know, you really need to get your stuff together. I'm gonna leave you. I ain't want to fool with nobody. I used to stay in the closet for a day or so. Just right there in the bedroom. Lock the door, don't want to be bothered. I had a good doctor, he was in Vietnam, that came back here with me. And I was going through some things. And he called VA up there in Oklahoma City. They sent me up there. I started seeing the psychiatrist. I went in the group. He said, man, you got post-traumatic stress. It was Monday, Wednesday, Friday, that's when I first started off. And I was in pretty bad shape. And I stayed in that group for about a year. They put me on some kind of medication that didn't work at all. It made me a little stupider, I think. Then they put me on the one I'm on now. And uh, after about, what, five, four, four, about four years, then they took me out of the therapy. And then I would go in and see a psychiatrist. There it, it was there in 60 days. Then if they see you and can prove it, they move it to uh, 90 days. You know, they'll move you back, move you back. It's not an overnight thing. It, it took months, but it, the relief that you that you have, knowing that somebody's actually listening, believing what you say, that's what really gets you going. I got this man. He believed me. So you go, you make your meetings, you make your conference calls, you do what you got to do. Now, I'm not gonna run from it. I, I'm living my life. If a guy been in any kind of traumatic area, he needs to get some professional help. There's help out there, but you got to make that move. I would advise to go get your help because I've been there. I see it every day at the VA clinic. Don't hide it. It's help.